We just got back to our favorite country in the world, Japan. After spending an amazing three weeks traveling around the Philippines, it was time to say goodbye. So we boarded an AirAsia flight for Cebu City and made the four-hour flight to Tokyo. We arrived about a week ago and we've really just been getting settled into our apartment in Asakusa because we're going to be here for two months this time. And of course, we did go to some of our favorite places, Kurosushi, Torikazoku, and Tiger Gyoza. And we kind of just got back to life as normal in Japan. For the next two months though, we have some pretty big plans. We'll be spending a week with seven other world schooling families visiting some of Tokyo's most famous and some of its not so famous sites. Then, my mom and dad will be flying in from the United States to spend my dad's 70th birthday and Thanksgiving with us. We'll also finally make it to Mount Fuji, where we have an epic couple of days of trains, gondolas, funiculars, and even some very interesting eggs. So let's get started right now, because today we're heading to the Pokemon Cafe in Nihambashi. Okay, yeah, we're in Tokyo. We haven't filmed since we got here, and that was like a week ago. We've just been eating food and relaxing and working and doing school and living here because that's what we want to do. But today is 30 days since Lindsay and I did something in Thailand. So about a month ago, we were in Thailand. Every afternoon, Lindsay had an alarm on her phone for four o'clock p.m. and we would log on to a certain website and try and get tickets for the Pokemon Cafe. It's really hard to get them. They open up the tickets 30 days in advance and you have to like be real fast with clicking buttons and making a reservation. 30 days ago, we finally got one of those reservations. So today we're heading to the Pokemon Cafe. I have no idea what it is, what to expect, but apparently it's popular. So we're heading and we're gonna go find out what it is. I said, hopefully it's not a long line. Well, we have reservations, so it shouldn't be a line at all. We absolutely love to stay in Asakusa when we come to Tokyo. There's just so much to do around here. It's close to lots of transportation. And of course, a view of the magnificent sky tree at almost every turn. Oh, and yes, it is pronounced Asakusa. The U is silent or devoiced. This is very common in many Japanese proper nouns and at the ends of lots of their words. The next stop is Asakusa. Okay, it says we have seven stops and Google Maps is pretty cool. It tells you what exits and entrances to go in when you're coming into the places. It also tells you what car to get on on the train to be close to the exit on the next station. So it's kind of cool. Okay, we just got to Niambashi, and the Pokemon Cafe is located on the fifth floor of the Takashimaya Shopping Center. Pokemon started as a game in the 90s, and these games featured creatures called Pokemon, which humans, known as Pokemon trainers, catch and train to battle each other. And the cafe is a themed cafe, with a menu inspired by the characters, even offering a chance to meet some in person, like Pikachu. It's a dive into a universe loved by millions, showcasing a unique slice of Japanese pop culture. All right, we're headed up to the Pokemon Cafe. As soon 
as we get off the elevator, we're greeted by an enormous Snorlax, who may or may not be my favorite Pokemon. He loves to sleep and eats nearly 900 pounds of food per day. Okay, yeah, so we're about mm, 20 minutes early, so we're gonna go check out the Pokemon shop, I guess. They want you to sit on it. <laughs> okay, follow the 235s. Hmm. We're next. <laughs> okay, so we got these different curries, all kinds of stuff. Right now. It looks no, like over here. over here against that wall. Okay. I love this. This one ball. Alright, let's get started. Alright, so we got our table and now we gotta figure out what we're getting. Okay, that's a pig or two mom on the pig though. <laughs> I get dumb. They're expensive. <laughs> but I what is two thousand? Fifteen dollars. Is it? Yeah. I think we'll do one of these, okay? And we're gonna share it. So it'll be rice and chicken. Okay, we're here, and we just ordered. And this place is not cheap. Um, I guess you can do that when you have people waiting fifteen days to try and get a reservation. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, it was like 7,500 yen for five drinks and a small kid's plate of food. So it's gonna be like $4. Oh yeah, it's a little steep. I don't know. Jellyfish or not? Yes. Uh, jellyfish? It's a sick. Uh, no, no, Kira. That's probably the name of it. No, no, Kira. Why are you so wine, Mama? Alright, we got some drinks and one food dish so that the girls can share. So, we'll see. This is mine. I'm excited. I guess we should look up who that is. Yeah. Hang on, let's do that real quick.
looks silly. Okay, use the straw mix. Use the straw mix. Oh my goodness, that is so, so good. Do you want to try it? Yeah. That is so good. <laughs> Look, honey, you got the grass thing. You're going to have a meal on there, okay? It's really good. So this is like an apple soda. Mm. Apple soda float. So it's got like, this is just vanilla ice cream, I think, but whipped cream is really good. And it's got this apple soda. It's really good. I want to kind of get it mixed up a little bit. I don't know how to do this though. <laughs> Oh, really good. That's it. Come from mine, just get Pokemon Go Star present for you. Okay. It's here. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, sorry, pick one. Thank you. Oh, me and you got the same. <laughs> cool. Daddy, you got the same one like me. That's awesome. <laughs> Okay, that was the Pokemon Cafe. It ended up being 7,524 yen, so about $50. You're going for the experience, not the food and prices, that's for sure. The food was pretty good, the girls liked the food, and the drinks were fun, and Pikachu came out at the end and danced for everyone, so that was a lot of fun. I think that's it for the day, we'll see you later. Please subscribe, like, leave a comment down below. Love you guys, bye, see you tomorrow. Three pumpkins? Yeah, going to say, ah, the three pumpkins. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're going to